Tally Hayes! Welcome back to my YouTube channel, or if you're new, hello, hi, welcome. My name is Tally Sharp, and it would mean the world to me if you could hit that subscribe button and become part of my little family. Okay, I don't know how much mess you can currently see, but we're moving house. We are moving out of my family home. It's been absolutely hectic, to say the least. But I wanted to still get a video up for you guys. I don't know what my makeup's saying, what I'm looking like. I literally just put a bit of bronzer on to try and make myself look better, you know? But I've actually really been needing like a pick-me-up. So that's actually what this video is. It's basically a 48 hour. I'm not actually sure how long it's gonna take me to fully film start to finish because of this move. But the general idea of it is basically to just pamper myself, get doled up for like a 48 hour glow up. I'm hoping to get my brows done, get a pedicure, get a wax, a Hollywood wax. Today I'm getting a hydrofacial by Alison Jeffrey. So excited. If you guys haven't had a hydrofacial, you're missing out. I think I told you in another vlog before, but that kind of like changed my skincare. So I'm going back today to get another one. I'm also getting laser hair removal on my stomach and hopefully my underarms, if they have time, we'll see. And then I'm gonna dye my hair again, just because I wanna go a little bit darker. Yesterday, I actually booked my flights to Malta. So I'm going there in September and I'm so excited. If this video does well, and you guys let me know, I will film another glow up holiday edition video for you guys. I'm gonna be getting my lashes done. I'm actually gonna be getting hand acrylics. You guys know that I have been trying to save some money because I'm trying to like save to buy my own place, hopefully one day. I mean, after this move, <laughs> I'm a little bit scarred. It's been so stressful, but, and just like a general holiday edition glow up. So yeah. Also a thumbs up this video and comment down below if you want an empty house tour of my family home. I was gonna film an empty house tour of my new home, but because that's gonna be my home and it's my family home, it didn't kind of feel right to do that. But of course, when I move out into my own place, you'll be getting all the goss and all the exclusives on that. Honestly, I'll show you a video of this room in a second. It's atrocious. So this, this morning I actually did some meditation. I have the Calm app, which I really, really love. And um, there's lots of different like meditations that you can do on there. They've also got like sleep stories. I'm sure you guys have heard of Calm. I've heard, I think it's a quote actually, but it's basically like meditation is a better prevention than cure or something like that. Basically saying that um, even if you feel like you don't need to meditate, you should always meditate because prevention is better than curing it when you get a little bit out of hand, a little bit flustered, if you struggle with that kind of thing, which I do, I'm a stress head, but you know. <laughs> so I just did like 10 minutes of that this morning and then I also had like a little workout. If you guys wanna see my workout routine, I'll leave it here. But yeah, I'm glowing up, you know, mentally, physically, and yeah, I'm excited about it. I don't think I'm gonna get my eyebrows done like by someone. I think I'm just gonna do them myself with some tweezers and some scissors to like trim them because they're hella long right now. This kind of self-love for me always makes me feel better. Like I've just been feeling like, even my skin has just been feeling like a little bit dull, a little bit lump, I was gonna say lumpy, ew a little bit textured. And yeah, I just want a little bit of a pick me up. So I'm super excited. Um, I don't actually know what the time is. Hopefully I'm not running late, but yeah, let's show you this room. Oh my God, I can't actually believe I'm showing you this. <laughs> Jeez, absolute mess. But believe it or not, I've actually packed up so much. This is all going to e-bloggers. So it's like all my new stuff. Um, that I don't want to keep, that I want to basically sell on, give some money to charity, stuff like that. All my bags are gone. Crazy. Okay, tally hoes, I'm here, and this is the facial that I'm getting. The Celebrity Hydrofacial. What's up, Molly May? <laughs> The lovely Tiana's actually 
fitting in my underarms for me, which is amazing. I'm so excited. So I'm gonna show you my laser first and then we're gonna do facial. If I just do the other ones yeah, first. of course. It's just a few hers I'm going to just shave. Okay. That's right. Lou knows now that I'm the worst shaver. Every time I come in, she's like, oh, you've left a bit. I'm like, oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. Still all feeling okay, though? Yeah, it's definitely warming up. That's it. Done on that. Nice. <laughs> okay tally hose now it's facial time literally i'm going to show you the gunk that comes out of my skin see it on that ew <laughs> hey, you can yeah you can see it that's crazy! Floating. Oh, you can see bits that are floating. Yeah, can you see them? I actually can't. So what is that? Just like my skin juice? Dead skin cells, yeah, anything that's come out, like the products are mixed with it as well. Blackheads. Yeah. Um, Love that though. No way, I think I did see a bit actually. Yeah. <laughs> okay, tally hose. So I have just come out of my facial basically and just driven up to Adsda. I need to get a few bits and bobs, you know. I also need to drop off this chair that's at the back. That was from my office. The uh, one leg of it was actually broken for the longest time. And um, every time you'd sit on it, you'd literally fall off the chair. So I think it's about time I got rid of that. But yeah, literally just had the facial. My skin is looking glowy, dewy. You know what I mean. You saw the gunk that came out of there. So I'm feeling good. Like tomorrow when I put on my makeup, scrum de Liam, shiz. There's a new McDonald's at my Asda. So I might have to get some, I'm definitely gonna get a frappe, all right? But I just don't know if I'm gonna get like some fries as well. I haven't decided yet. Do you know what I should really do? for this like 48 hour glow up challenge it's not really a challenge it's just that i want to do it <laughs> a massage a full body massage now if that isn't like a pick me up self-love then i don't really know what is to be honest <laughs> it's like something that you do like as a treat or like every now and again but i can always refilm this kind of video for you guys if you enjoy it i feel like the lighting is shocking but yeah i'll catch up with you later and get some more things done. <laughs> I'm feeling my outfit today. Just the chilled everyday look. I'm off to get a Hollywood wax. One of my favorite things to do. You feel so good afterwards. Oh, my alarm going off to say get out the house. <laughs> um, so yeah, going to get a Hollywood wax and then I'm going to get a pedicure afterwards, which I'm super excited about. I'm gonna take you along with me. Honestly, pedicure, Hollywood wax, favorite of all of them literally you feel so good afterwards i also worked out this morning i did a core exercise and i did some like back and arms and shoulders so i'm gonna probably be feeling it tomorrow but yeah i don't want to run late so i'll catch you up when i'm there it is it looks beautiful <laughs> we're here you want to say hi naked and spread my legs on here I'm in the bed I'm on the bed and I haven't been here in two months so I'm super hairy or maybe two and a half months I don't know she's just putting powder on my vag <laughs> talc free talc free powder is that just to make sure the area is dry yes it's help with the damp weather Oh, no! It's <laughs> better than ice cream or something. <laughs> just saying that. No, it's no, not no. like painful. I don't think it's ever been painful, painful for me. I think I've got a good pain threshold, but also you are good. Your technique, you always put pressure mm -hmm. and stuff. So, so okay. it's not painful, but the longer the hair is, the more painful, right? Not really. The longer uh, is the best because grab properly and it uh, lasts longer. 
Because then you don't have to leave the ones in between. Yeah, there we go. So Small hopefully... hair is never a problem. So yeah. this is going to be the best wax of my life then. Best oh, of her life. she's pulling. <laughs> <laughs> it's not that bad. You guys should try it. It is not. I just don't like shaving. I hate shaving. No, no, no. It no, comes no, back no. every day, and you're no just reason. thinking, Razor's such a waste of time. Enemy number one of the vaginas. <laughs> no razor here. This is why I love coming here. She makes me <laughs> laugh as well. <laughs> Hi, Tally Hose. Right. Oh. So I've just finished, um, it only takes like half an hour, it's so quick, so easy. I'll leave her link down in the description bar so you guys can have a little look if you're in the Brighton area. Honestly, I'm not going to have to worry about this for weeks now, so I'm so excited. Like, if I manage to book a holiday, I'll be all sorted. <laughs> I didn't get to vlog too much in there because honestly, she is such a legend. I say this every time I vlog, but... We have so much to talk about and I just love her company so but now I am gonna go and get a pedicure which I'm also so excited about. I'm not 100% sure what colour that I want to go for. I'm thinking blue. I wear blue so much though but I do think it's like a vibe or maybe I'll just stick to white but we'll see when we get there. Damn the decisions are hard. I'm thinking 99 is really cute or just white but guys look at them Oh, cute. Hold on, I give, give for me, I put nibid oil for you. Okay. Thank you. Perfect. Thank you. Picture, picture good. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Cute. Yay. I'm holiday ready now. Not that I'm going on holiday, but. <laughs> oh my God, it actually smells incredible here. Literally, I can smell pizza, Mediterranean food food i am well up <laughs> for a little spain holiday okay so we are basically done for today um i'm gonna do my hand nails i told you guys before that i'm gonna start to do my hand nails at home using gel um i kind of need a new gel kit so if you have any good cheap recommendations please pop them down below let me know the one i'm using at the moment not gonna lie not great it takes ages to dry and even after that it's like sticky <laughs> so it's not the greatest but yeah i'm gonna paint my fingers like pink maybe but yeah and then tomorrow i'm gonna pop to the shop get some hair dye um then do my fingernails and also we're gonna fake tan together as well because i don't think i've ever fake tan with you guys on camera before so that would be cute so i'll catch up with you tomorrow Mwah. hi tally hoes from my very messy bedroom um so today we are gonna dye my hair i popped it to asda and i got some hair dye this is the one that i got i decided to go for black this time just because i don't know you know <laughs> from one extreme to the other but um how fit does she look and i just <laughs> wanted to look like her so this kind of looks like a natural brown so I'm excited about that. Um, my friend is coming over very soon, Chloe. You've met her before and she's going to do it for me. And also I'm gonna fake tan, but I forgot to shave my legs and that's a bit of a problem. Also, like I don't know actually how I'm going to fully, maybe I'll just show you the top half of how I do it. I don't really know. Also, all of my stuff is packed. So it's not like the genuine, stuff that I would normally use. I just literally picked it up from Savers not long ago. You know, I love a good Savers trip. I literally have like no moisturizer left. Sad times, absolute fave. Um, I don't think I'm gonna take this to the new house. I think I'm just gonna buy a new one because it's basically finished. But yeah, this is the one that I got from Savers. St. Moore, St. Moore is? There's a hair stuck on it. Tanning mousse in dark. Used it before, it's okay. Nothing special. So I'm gonna use these on like my drier patches, um, like my elbows, my birthmark on my neck, 
my knees, my feet and my hands. Um, and also I got, I've had it for a while actually, um, so, and I just haven't really been using it very well, um, but I have used it like a few times and it was pretty good. It's the Isle of Paradise like self tanning drops for the face so that hopefully I don't break out. I look so washed out in this clip right now. I don't really know what's going on. I decided I'm not gonna do my hands today because I just can't be bothered. Like honestly, my machine takes so long. I need a new one, like honestly, and it's still sticky. Like my friend was doing it on my hands for like, not even joking about three hours and it was still sticky. So, anybody got time for that at the moment? Going to a family event tomorrow, so I'm super excited about it. Oh my god, nearly forgot to tell you the best part of the night. I got my favourite Chardonnay wine from Asda. If you're under 18, <laughs> don't watch this part. No, I'm joking. But if you're under 18, you probably don't like wine anyway, let's be honest. But I got the Chardonnay Australia. Listen, take a screenshot. <laughs> because this is the best white wine. I like it, it's my favorite. It just goes down really smoothly. Like it's not bitter, not sour, not too sweet, not too bitter, it's just perfect. And yeah, it's my favorite one. And do you want to know how I found it out? <laughs> Basically, there was this old lady and she was down the wine aisle and she picked it up and I was like, she clearly was like looking for it. So she knows what she's talking about. And I just went behind her and grabbed it, got the same one. So now we have my favorite. Maybe we're just gonna have to like sit here and do it. Um, do my hair like this, I don't know. And Chloe has never done someone else's hair before. So wish me luck, girl, wish me luck. But it should be okay. And the fact that we're moving house is why I'm doing this because honestly, my mum would not allow me to do this if we weren't moving. Kind of haven't told her actually. I need like a little table here, you know? I need to decide what I'm doing first. I feel like I should fake tan afterwards because you know when you wash your hair? Oh my God. What if it gets really late and I don't have time to fake tan? We'll see. It's really not that entertaining anyway. Right, one. Okay, so you put the powder into the two, I think. I need the instructions because, okay, that's the conditioner. So we don't need that yet. Oh, forgot to put it in the fridge. FFS. Okay, Tally Ho, this has been a change of plan. Chloe's not coming, so we're a one man show. First thing I had to do is open up the wine. Also, the glasses are on because this means business. Right, I'm gonna try and figure this whole shenanigan out and I will be back. Tally Ho's, for some reason, I just sniff this and I almost died. <laughs> Shaky, 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 shaky. Lucky us, we got another bottle to do. Second one. Loki, feel like a little scientist mixing all the potions. Okay, so we have a mirror. We have the two things. We have a towel on the floor, a towel around me. And we're good to go. I think I'm gonna, should I take my earrings out? I don't know. Oh, I'm so nervous. I've literally never done this before, so. Wish me luck. Also, <laughs> got the wine. And Love Island's on in half an hour. So I have half an hour to do this and then leave it in. I think an hour's too long. I need to read what the box says, but. Good morning, Tally Hoes. This is the final hair result. It's the morning after. It has caught so well. I'm so happy that I actually like left the color on for much longer than I should have. Literally got through majority of Love Island with my hair in, but I'm very happy I did because it's really caught so nicely. I kind of feel like a Greek princess, I don't know, or Egyptian. Something that involves really dark hair. <laughs> I honestly, guys, got so drunk last night. I didn't manage to film anything else. I didn't manage to do my eyebrows or my fake tan. I can't believe it. I'm so sorry. Honestly, it's really not that good anyway. Like I literally just, ah, my camera just died. I've got no more space. So I'm having to film on my iPhone. Sorry about the mess. Tally hose, I did so much packing this morning. I'm so happy about it. We're off to like a family barbecue. It's meant to be my niece's birthday. Um, but she got pinged or something 
um, with the coronavirus. So um, she's not even going to be there, which is so sad. But yeah, I'm all ready. This is the final result. I'm so happy about it. Before my camera died, I was just saying that like, really my, ooh, my fake tan routine isn't very like interesting. I literally just moisturize those spots that I told you about and then go over with the mitt. I use the Saint-Tropez mitt and it's actually pretty good. I'll try and leave it linked down below. Uh, today I'm just wearing my jumpsuit that I got from Boohoo, it's in my last haul. So check out that haul if you haven't done already. And yeah, I'm honestly starving. I'm so excited about going for this family barbecue. Please don't forget to thumbs up this video. I really, really hope that you enjoyed it. I honestly really wanna do the holiday prep one because I feel like I'm gonna whiten my teeth. I'm gonna get eyelash extensions. I'm definitely gonna fake tan. Um, I probably won't dye my hair again for a while because I've really been putting it through a lot recently um look how shiny this is why i oh my god my room this is why i love having such dark hair because it just shines so nicely i use my ghds to straighten it and some hair oil and this is the look so do let me know if you want that video i love you guys so much and i'll see you very soon for my next video